so when I when I opened the bag, the I went to one of our neighbor, one woman. I now ask her. I say I need Bible. So she even afraid. She said, why should I ask a Bible like this? And because my parents are helping her children, she says she does not want any problem. I say no, I just want to read. So as I brought the Bible, I opened the Bible, I begin to see Jeremiah, Isaiah, I say Christian are mad people. I throw it on the ground. I say they are studied the old name of the prophet. So I now sat down, I slept up. When I opened my eyes, I saw the Quran on the ground, the Bible on top of my bench. And I know that I cannot carry Quran and throw Quran on the ground. I now are surprised. I now carry the Bible. I kept it on the ground. I carry stone and put on top. I now take back my Quran on the table. So when I slept the second time, when I opened my eyes, I saw the Quran on the ground, the carry stone put on top. And they carry the Bible put on the top of the table and they shifted it closer to me. So there is one girl that I was teaching her. I now thought she was the one that doing all this thing to me. I now pushed the bench. I got up angrily. I say I will teach her a lesson today. When I step one, two, I now heard someone call my name at back. And I turned, I saw Jesus Christ standing. And his light, the light that is shining on me, I have never seen a light like that. And he told me he is the way, he is the truth, he is the life. Without him, nobody will see his father. And he said, did I know that through me, many people are going to enter heaven? And he said, if I reject this way, me and many people, we are going to have fire again. So there are many things that he told me, which I cannot even recall them back for now. When they heard that I changed, they tried, they begin to bring some leaves. They begin to bath me. They will take me out. They do many incantations. I did not change. They will ask me. Are you for Muhammad or for Jesus? I will say I'm for Jesus. So Imam came. They now conclude what they will do is to kill me. They now dig a hole at our backyard. They now took me there. They tied me. They used the knife to slaughter me. The knife now enter. So they now brought me. I have an elder brother who is a policeman. He shoot me with gun. The gun no start. My father carry acid and pour on me. Nothing happened to me. So they now tied me on the mango tree. They bring bottle that they want to use the bottle to pieces my head. They hit me with one. The bottle scatter and wound one of them, but nothing happened to me. So it's from then now I ran away. So I met one pastor. So he now pray for me. I stay with him. There is no any charm that I have and I believe it's because of Jesus Christ called me and he's the one that protects me. Uh, my pastor brought me here to this school in order to be teach the word of God. And my teachers are trying, they are teaching me the word of God and in fact they are helping me physically and spiritually. My name is Ibrahim Abdullahi and my tribe I am a Flani. Uh, I was a Muslim before but now a Christian.